One of the things that has recently come to our attention is that the Apple products, including iPads, iPhones, and iPod Touches, they have a difficult time accessing our online textbook. So what Pearson, our textbook company, has recently come up with for a solution is they've recommended that we download Puffin Academy onto our Apple products in order to get the Flash-based online textbook to work. So I'm going to take you through the step-by-steps of how to do just that. Your first step is to head to your App Store. Once you're in the App Store, you want to search for Puffin. And if I click on that, you can see that that brings up my choices. Puffin Academy with the purple background, that's the one that you want to download. So I'm going to select that. And I'm going to say that I'd like to download that. You may have to enter a password if your device is password protected. I have to do just that on mine. Once you've entered your password, it should download the new app and start to install it. So we'll wait for that to happen. Then you can click on Open to open the browser. Once you've opened your browser, you want to go ahead and search for Pearson, which is the name of our textbook company, P-E-A-R-S-O-N, and you want the one that says Pearson Success Net. So I'm going to select that, and if you click on that link, it will bring you right to our online textbook page. When you click on Login, that will bring you to the login screen. And then from there, what I'd like you to do is go up into these three dots in the upper right hand corner and bookmark that page. If you click on Add Bookmark, then from there you can go ahead and change the title. I'm going to change mine to LA Online Textbook. Click on Save, and now you have that page bookmarked. So the next time you go into Puffin, from your device. Chances are good it'll bring you right back to where you were. If it doesn't, let's say I click on no and it doesn't bring me there, if I go back up into those three dots and click on bookmarks, there's my LA Online Textbook. There's only one other change that you'll need to make once you get yourself logged in. Keep in mind your username and password is your school Gmail address. So it's um, your school ID number followed by at mystma.org, and your password is the same as your network password. Mine looks a little bit different because I have a, an account that's good for all students. Then you can click on Sign In, and from there you'll be able to access the textbook. There may be one more change that you need to make. When you click on Open Book, chances are good it's going to give you a pop-up blocker. You can disable the pop-up blocker for the Puffin browser by again going under those three dots in the upper right hand corner, clicking on settings, and turning off your pop-up blockers. So from green to black, back into settings, and now when I click on open book, the online textbook will load and open on my Apple product. That is everything you need to know for your step-by-steps for how to get to the Puffin browser and access our online textbook. And the best part of all, the solution was free. Hooray!